What's going on guys? Just thought I'd do a little update on a little project I'm doing here. Um, it's the AMT 75 Gremlin. I started doing this um, I started doing this project because in the uh, every year at the NNL North they do they have the regular show and then they do like theme builds inside the show which I'm sure most shows are like that. Uh, I know most of the ones that I've been to are. They have a theme for um, American compact cars. Now, it's my understanding that you can build this kit for that theme. Not sure about, because I haven't got an answer if you can do what I'm doing to it um, for the theme. But if, if, you know, if I get there and find out that, you know, I can't enter it into that part of the contest, I'll put it out on a different table and, and see what we do there. Um, you know, now with that being said, it's going to be a long, drawn-out project. Uh, as it's, um, it's starting to get winter. Well, not really winter. It's still fall here in Minnesota, but it's it's starting to get cold. Um, so, you know, this is going to be one of my winter projects. Um, I'm just going to work a little on it, put it away. If I get frustrated, work on something else. Bring this back out, work on it again. Um, you know, through the winter here, and then and by the time the show starts, hopefully I'll finish. I've got plenty of time. Uh, i got till May. Um, but I am going to uh, try to detail it out uh, as best I can. Um, probably put some crazy paint job on it. And, um, you know, but like I say, I've, I've been working on it a couple of days. Uh, let me get this box out of the way. I'll get it set up in front of the camera and give you all a look at uh, what i got going on. Oh, crap. All right, there we go. That's what we got going on with this kit. I uh, took the tubs. I took the tubs, uh, basically the whole rear rear section out of the, um, well, basically the chassis, uh, rear suspension, front suspension, wheels, tires, is all out of the uh, Revell 67 Pro Street Chevelle. Um... This is what I'm using to kit bash it with. Uh, I took, um, I had to take, what I did was I cut the back half off like you normally would across the cross brace. I would pick it up and show you, but it'll fall apart. And I'm, you know, um, or across that back brace there in the back, you know, where we normally cut them off. I cut it off there. Then I took a section out of it um, to shorten it up enough to fit in under here. And I think I've gotten it pretty well where I want it. Um, you know, I I like the right height of it so far. Um, that is fully assembled right now. It's just mocked together. But the rear end of all, the rear section, rear suspension, I've got all painted and, and, and put together and detailed out and stuff like that. And I don't know if you, maybe I'll give you a look at it here in a minute. Uh, this hood. I'm not sure about the hood. I'm not sure about what engine I'm putting in it yet. Um, I've got a couple ideas. One, I'm not even sure if it even fit in there. The other one, I'm pretty sure it'll fit. Um, I've just got to get it ordered and it's coming this way. Uh, I, I, I just haven't done it yet. Like I say, it's, it's going to be an on and off project. I'm really in no hurry. Uh, there's still some stuff that I could be working on with this thing before I worry about a engine and all that. I could be doing my body work and everything, but I, um, I'm probably going to put this away for a couple of days now because I've got something else that I want to do. Um, I wanted to, uh, wanted to try to do something for, um, St. Jude's, so I'm going to try to figure something out for that. Um, but yeah, like I say, I don't know if, I know the kit, you, if you build it, you can enter it in the theme, but I don't know if you can enter it quite like this. Although it is still an American Compact, and it's just, you know. <laughs> um, but my battery's telling me it's dying. And it shut my light off. 
so I'm I'm gonna make this a little short, guys. Uh, like I say, that's what I'm doing. Uh, let me know what you think, and uh, I'll talk to you guys later.